What's going on everybody? It's Marcellus here back with another video and today we're going to be talking about the comparison between Bitcoin, Bitcoin SV and Bitcoin Cash. So Bitcoin is it's not growing too much because we were already hit like such a huge point in Bitcoin. So it's only up 7% for the month. But if you come over here to Bitcoin Cash, you can see we're up 27% for the month. And if you look at Bitcoin SV, it's similar, but we're up 45% for the month for Bitcoin SV. So I actually think we may have more growth potential in Bitcoin SV and Bitcoin Cash in the short term because if we go over here to Bitcoin, like we've already went up so much and we just need to, it's just kind of consolidating around this point right here. So we definitely need to get above 61,000, above 65,000 in order to see more growth with Bitcoin. But I definitely see Bitcoin Cash growing way faster than it because every, t every single week, we're always getting more growth in Bitcoin Cash. We're getting more jumps. And it's not dropping as much like it's not fluctuating as much as Bitcoin. If you come over here and look at Bitcoin, you can see, yeah, Bitcoin's going up, but then it goes down just as much. It goes up, but then it goes down just as much. The last three months was actually good for Bitcoin, but the last month has been really stagnant for Bitcoin. And then if we go over here to Bitcoin SV, yeah, we're down 2.28% today. But then you look at the week, we're up 11.59%. And then for the month, we're up 44%. And then only 33 for uh, 38 for the three month, but we're still doing good for the last month. And as you can see, I don't, I don't have like hardly any Bitcoin SV. I hardly have any Bitcoin cash, but that's because, you know, like I said before, all my money is tied up inside Ethereum Classic. Only have 7,000 in there, and I like to put all my eggs in one basket because people say not to do it, so I do it. <laughs> but no, but seriously, I put all my money in Ethereum Classic because I'm actually really bullish on it. I really believe that it's going to go high. But uh, yeah, Bitcoin, Bitcoin SV, and Bitcoin Cash, I feel like between those three, in the short term, Bitcoin Cash and Bitcoin SV have the bigger, the greater opportunity to grow. But Bitcoin, we will definitely see 100K. I want to see 100K by the end of the year in Bitcoin. And then when we talk about Bitcoin Cash, I want to see 1,000 by the end of the year in Bitcoin Cash. And then Bitcoin SV, I want to see... I would say I want to see close to a thousand by the end of the year also. And I definitely think we will hit that. We were actually all the way up here before. And as you can see, Bitcoin SV is more it's more stable than Bitcoin uh the regular Bitcoin. It's more stable. As you can see, it, it it's only been out since 2018. We've had a jump back here, but then we jumped or then we dropped. But yeah, as you can see, Bitcoin SV loves to go up high and then go down. So Bitcoin SV is the best one to swing trade, in my opinion, because, well, the best between Bitcoin SV Cash and Bitcoin is the best to swing trade because we're always having these fluctuations and it would have been good to buy it there and sell it there. But, you know, it's hard to track these things. So it's best to, you know, buy and hold for at least a week and then sell if you think that you're up. But yeah, definitely check out Bitcoin SV and Bitcoin Cash because in the short term, they may have more returns than Bitcoin. But as you can see for the day, Bitcoin is up. And the only other thing that is up is Ethereum. And like I said before, Bitcoin and Ethereum actually kind of follow the same path. Like if you look over here at Bitcoin, their one week, it looks kind of similar to Ethereum's one week. Actually, it looks very similar. And if you look at Bitcoin's one month, it looks very similar to Ethereum's one month. So... Yeah, Bitcoin and Bitcoin SV and Bitcoin Cash, I definitely see big and great opportunities. Bitcoin is like the original crypto, so it's going to continue to go up. And we should see $100,000 by the end of the year in Bitcoin. And I'm definitely going to put more money in Bitcoin. I'm just trying to grow my money in other places so then I have more money to spread and diversify. But yeah, if you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe, check out the link in the description, and click that link to get your free stock for signing up for Robinhood. And I'll be back at it again with another video. Take care.